Hey guys, Machines and Mala here. Just want to show you what we picked up tonight off a local buy and sell website. Uh, someone posted three rotor tillers for um, $250 and I went and took a look at them and it turned out to actually be more like three and a half rotor tillers. And uh, they were all kind of sitting in a field under tarps, obviously well used. But um, over the few last few years, we've worked on a few of these types of tillers before and gotten to learn that they're pretty bulletproof. They um, last and last and last. And we figured for about $50 each, say $60 each, cost-wise, we should be able to um, make our money back hopefully two, three, maybe four times. Um, like for example, this, this horse model here, it's got the Keystart 10 horsepower engine. And uh, I've sold these before for $400, maybe a little bit more if it cleans up real nice. This one looks to be in pretty good shape. Um, this one over here is an Arians version of that rotor tiller. It looks to be a little bit newer. It's actually got a, a replacement engine. Someone's put a Power Fist 13 horsepower engine on it. So obviously the original engine blew up. Um, it looks like it's got key start so it might be worth putting a, a battery onto this to make it start by itself. It would appeal to a lot more buyers. Um, the RT8020 model not sure what the 8020 stands for perhaps 20 inch or 20 horsepower or 80 centimeters i don't know we'll look that up um, then we've got this old arians rocket 7 which is just basically the the front half of a rotor tiller the tractor half no motor but the, the wheels and the tires look good so we could probably use those on one of these two or sell them separately someone may want this if they've got another one of these machines for parts. We consider that the freebie. And then there's this little one here. This one was, I believe, called the Pony, the Troy Built Pony. And uh, it's a smaller version of the horse that we showed you first. Um, this one, this is just a little guy. It's got a Tecumseh. It looks like a, looks like a five horse maybe on there. It's nice and small, so it's narrow. It's good for someone who's got a little garden. Um, these will clean up really nice guys with some citrus clean and pressure washing and maybe a little touch up paint and uh, I, I tried giving them a pull this one pulls over it's got some compression so we'll probably get that running uh, the 13 horsepower same thing it's got good compression um, this one on the other hand is kind of stuck I tried pulling it over it's stuck, so we're not sure if that's because it's hydrolocked or because it's seized. I haven't checked to see if there's any oil in it, but um, yeah, a little project. We'll probably do a couple videos on each of these as we see if they fire and see if they go. A good sign they've all got air in the tires, it means they haven't been sitting for that long, unless the seller pumped them up before we got there. I doubt it, they were out, they were out far in a field under tarps. So. Um, yeah, stay tuned. We'll make some more videos on these things and uh, Yeah, subscribe for more videos like this Thanks for watching